What's up, YouTube? My name is Jason, and this is my take. And I'm back with another video, and today we're going to be reviewing the new collab album from the Baby and NBA Youngboy, Better Than You. Yes, the Baby is teamed up with NBA Youngboy, and I can't say that I saw this coming, but um, it, it kind of makes sense. These are two very big artists, especially in mainstream hip hop, very strong core fan bases. And, you know, it seems like the time was right. Now, on the baby side, he's coming off of an EP back on my Baby Jesus Again um, project, which I reviewed and which was awful. Um, still is not good, um, but that's the past. And NBA Youngboy's last album, Colors, um, was a project that wasn't amazing um, or anything, but it was definitely um, a project that I was a little more impressed with compared to his um, project Sincerely Control from last year. You know, so going into this project, I was just curious. I was curious as to how it's going to sound. Um, in terms of production, what were we leaning towards? A more the baby sounding album, more young boy sounding album? And just how would they mesh together? What, what would the chemistry be like? And what I'll say is this, um, I, I think that the baby and young boy work very well together um, and how they feed off one another. Um, but unfortunately, the production choices on here and just how the, the rapping and, and some of the lyrics just ruined what could have been something really great. On these 12 tracks, we get uh, we get typically what we get from the baby and typically what we get from Youngboy. I enjoyed the track on this line. This honestly felt like a typical Youngboy type song. It was a banger for sure. This was probably my favorite song in terms of the baby and Youngboy just trading bars back and forth. Um, they, they really were, were feeding off of each other. I love NBA Youngboy singing on the hook for the song Little To A Lot. Both of them and the baby gave solid performances and they both dive into, you know, just coming from nothing and to now being famous and having a lot and just wanting to make sure that the people around them were taken care of and, and putting people on, um, which, which is very dope. And, and it's always cool to see artists just take care of others who came up with them. The song Turbo is also a highlight for me. I don't know, I really enjoy like the, the video game sample and how it was used. Like it gave off like a rap like rock star type feel. And honestly, this is one of those songs where the baby and young boy sounded their most comfortable together on this project. Probably my favorite instrumental on the project was the song Head Off. It, it honestly felt like the most complete beat on the project and we'll get into more of the production later. And I really love how young boy came in rapping. He really set the tone for this one. And I think that, that that energy really fed off on the baby and how he came in and ended things he delivered as well. But guys, that unfortunately ends the highlights for this thing. We gotta dive into some of the, the mediocre to bad moments on here that mainly start with the production because I've never really considered Young Boy to have a bad ear for beats. Um, but with the baby, I do. So some some of these songs just it just just weren't cutting it for me. I really wish that I liked the intro track hit because I thought that flow wise this might have been the best song in terms of how Young Boy and the Baby sounded with their verses. But that chorus of Young Boy just saying hit was just trash. This beat was trash. Another example of this is on the song Wi-Fi. Honestly, it was just like confusing me at times because the production I feel like should be so much better for artists that, at the caliber of the baby and young boy. It's just so generic. And, and you know, rappers like, like especially like the baby, like it's cool like that you can make so many songs and record them so quick and get them out. But like, you know, sometimes it's cool to just like take your time, you know, get get some more, you know, fleshed out beats and, and really just like take your time in the process because th this this song was bad. And the baby had this line where it's like, I'm gonna send somebody to your house, like some pizza or something. Yeah, I feel like BBL had potential um, it, it had a, a, a solid piano pattern that, that was sticky, but when the drums came in, they were just like really low, like like the, the beat didn't bang like it was supposed to. And especially the 808s, they sounded really drowned out, um, which, which was very disappointing. Easily the worst song on this project was Syracuse. I'm still sitting here right now trying to understand why Youngboy's vocals were pitched up so high uh, for the hook and part of his verse. like. This was an awful decision. And it set the tone 
for this song like off the rip like like it, it, it already just made me not interested off the jump look so like like i said like i i feel like it's just so disappointing because these two fit very well together but to me it just didn't come together uh, for a consistent like solid project but i can't lie like this is, this is making me very curious like I, I really hope this isn't the last time these two work together like, I think that they have the potential to make something really solid. I got glimpses of the old the baby that I really rock with. And Youngboy, to me, is just continuously improved. And that kind of came together here in a way. Um, so I, I'll be interested to, to see if they want to do something like this again, uh, a sequel or you know something of a different name, because uh, I, I think they have something in them. So I'm going to give this album a 4 out of 10. What were you guys' thoughts on this new The Baby and NBA Youngboy collab album? Did you love it? Did you hate it? What were your favorite tracks? Let's have a discussion down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. Got another video coming. Please like and subscribe to the channel. I'm Jason. This has been my take. And I'll see you guys next time.